I want to explain briefly exactly what Exit Splash does and what it is, just in case you got here and you're not too sure what this is all about. Exit Splash is actually a single file, one script. That's it. This is a very, very small script, which is also very, very powerful. So I just want to stress exactly what Exit Splash is so I can kind of, you can basically understand where to go from here. So that's why I wanted to do this little intro video of what really is Exit Splash. Again, it's just a single file. Okay? Now, what does that single file do? It basically is a glorified redirection script with some really fancy kind of behind the scenes features that happens to help increase the rate at which people stay on your exit page or your web page. I just call it an exit page. Let me illustrate it using some drawing here. Let me bring up the little drawing tool. So you have a web page here that you're selling something. It's probably your sales page. Let's put you for an S sales page or membership site or something like that, right? And you have a lot of people coming into this into this site from all over the place, from your, your traffic coming in, right? And then also a lot of people are leaving your website and not doing anything. They're not buying anything from you. So you're just losing out all of this traffic here. And, uh, you know, it turns out that uh, like not over 95% of your traffic, they just leave. They're not interested in what you're doing. Well, that traffic, you can use that traffic for a lot of stuff. And Exit Splash gives you the ability to capture that traffic that's leaving your site by redirecting it to another page of your choice. And this is the exit page that you need to create and specify where you want to go, basically. So that's all it is. Exit Splash is just, is, is just the basically the... Um, the process of going from this page to this page. What goes on in here is what Exit Splash does. It's a single script. I know it seems kind of easy, and there's no database, there's no login, there's no nothing like that. Just one file. That's why it's so powerful. Now let me show you how to use it here. Or sorry, not show you how to use it. Let me show you um, what it does. I just got to get rid of my little pen tool here. There we go. Now I'm just on my ExitSplash.com website here. And currently, when I'm recording this video, I'm in the pre-launch stage. And um, I'm actually using Exit Splash on my main page here. So this is my sales page. Well, technically, this is just a squeeze page. It can be used on a sales page. I've also used it in another sales page. I'm going to show you in a moment. Now, when I try to leave my website, I have to close the little X button up here or close this button here. That's usually how you leave a website, right? You close down the browser. And there's absolutely no way of getting getting away from this. So if you close down the browser, this little warning comes up. Now what's going on now, the exit splash script is taking over. And it's going to try and tell me, hey, wait, click the cancel button on the next window. All right? I know you want to leave our website. And now you can probably hear that audio in the background. Cancel button on that little window you see right now to get something you were not expecting. Okay, I just waited till that audio was done. That's another feature that I integrated, which I'll get into in the other videos, but I just want to show you how this works. So now that you see this window here, and behind the scenes down here, like over here, that's another HTML page. I'm calling it an exit splash page. It's just a regular old web page. Nothing fancy there, right? And what you see up top here is an image which is instructing me, hey, you need to click that cancel button. I call that an impact image. So what they do is they click the cancel button and it disappears and now they're on the actual exit page. On this page is where you can do all sorts of stuff. Now on this particular page you're looking at right now what I'm doing is capturing people into a list. Getting their name and email into a list. All right. Let me show you another example. Media Shock FX is a product that I recently uh, purchased the rights to, and I was selling it as a product. And if people come to this site, look through my website, and decide to leave and not purchase, they go to hit the little button. Again, the warning window comes up. I know you want to leave our website. And you can see that the another exit page comes up. And also, you will notice a bar at the top here. You don't have to include Powered by Exit Splash top bar if you don't want, but I highly recommend it because you can earn money from it. 
meaning your affiliate link will be plugged in here. When people see this on your site and they go, hey, what's this? Powered by Exasplash. They go and click that link. You're going to get you're going to get a commission if they come to my site, buy my product. I'll pay you. Sounds pretty cool, eh? Now let's just take a look at this Exit Splash page we're looking at right now. It's just a regular web page I created, and on this page I'm using a viral Twitter component, which I have also included in um, this entire package. You also have access to a viral Twitter uh, thing I created for you. But let's just look at this one. What I'm doing here on this exit page is when people enter their Twitter username and password and click this little button, what's going to happen is this tweet, this message, will be sent to their followers. Okay. As a result, if they send this tweet out to their followers, I will give them two free videos. So if you go and tweet now, it brings you to another page where you can get these three, these two free videos. So the idea is if the website visitors that are trying to leave your site come to this page, if they send a simple tweet out to their followers, they get a free gift. Pretty cool, eh? And that's the purpose of the Exit Splash script. All it does, it redirects your exit traffic to any page that you want. I, I've used it on many other websites. Let me show you another example. Let's go to one of my other sites, Dave's Online Videos.com. If you try to leave this site here, Another Exit Splash page comes up. Oops, I guess you gotta have it finish loading. There's online videos. There we go. Just finish this loading here, and then you try to leave. I know you want to leave our website, but I highly recommend. Now what I'm doing here is I've actually redirected them to a new newsletter that I'm working on. It's a newcashtips.com but you see the power of that I didn't actually send them to an HTML page I sent them to a completely different website so that's another way you can do this this is a it's just a squeeze page for a newsletter so my exit traffic from one of my websites I decided you know what they're leaving my site why not monetize that I threw them to another website there I'm collecting name and email now here's another thing you can do you don't have to send them to another one of your websites. You can send them to an affiliate website through your affiliate link. That's another thing you can do with Exit Splash. So there's so many things you can do. So you've got to understand that Exit Splash is just a single script that gives you the ability, the ability to redirect your exit traffic to any web page or website you want, any link. So that's what Exit Splash is, a single script which gives you the ability to redirect your exit traffic to any page you want. All right. Hopefully I didn't confuse anyone and I was clear enough. And uh, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.